a brilliant fellow named Blathers has joined us on Lith Harbor. Blathers has a keen interest in biology, past and present, and he's here to study in Lith Harbor. I sincerely hope everyone lends their cooperation. Okie dokie. Hold on, I want to try to get some sticks and stuff in this bug that I don't remember if I caught. Alright, there's so many beetles. Yo! <laughs> Got him! Let's go talk to Blathers real quick. And this is where he set up his tent. Looks pretty good. Oh yeah, here's all the fish. So I do have that beetle. He's right here. But I really want to get a shovel. But first let's talk to Blathers. That's the most important thing. That's the thing we announced at the beginning. That's the thing we're gonna go to. Hey Blathers. Look at his little water tanks. Oh, a pleasure to meet you. My name is Blathers. I'm exceedingly interested in the ecosystem of this island. This, I have come to conduct research, if you will. Aha, could it be that you are Kuri, the personage who chose this island for this tent? Oh, the location of this island. I can read. That's right. I want to sound smart, so I'm going to say that's right instead of I am. A splendid job indeed. Thanks to you, I was able to alight this on this island with nary a ruffled feather. Truth be told, I am determined to open a museum and henceforth dwell on this island amongst you. So, should you discover a new type of insect or fish, do be so in uh, kind to bring it here. Though I confess there's one smallish problem regarding this museum. I lack the number of exhibits needed to secure permission to open up museum proper. Which is where you come in, Wat Wat. Allow me to explain. Okay. So he's like telling me about all this good good. There you see, with wood gathered from Lith Harbor, we can make a vaulting pole. Yo, let's go. I want to vault myself over things. I sent DIY schematics for a shovel and dig fossil. So now we got the shovel we needed. Cross the river and seek out these ancient re relics. My feathers. But I have blathered far too long. If I am to open a museum, I must acquire more items to exhibit. Fifteen more, to be precise. I fervently hope you do donate your precious finds to the cause. No problem. I got you, blathers. I got you. I tell. Okie dokie. We got a vaulting pole and sticks and stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and dono all of these thingies. I do believe this means yes, huzzah, hooray, we've acquired the number of specimens required. Wait, acquired, required, that threw me off so bad. At last we can submit our application to build a proper museum. Oh, oh my, I must make haste and prepare for the museum's opening, there's so much to do, hoodie hoo. Thank you so much, Corey. No problem. I guess we'll open it tomorrow. Hooray! I haven't seen one of these yet, let's go. Let's see what we get. I'm actually finally excited to get more bottles. Boot gave me a wooden table mirror. Hooray! I'm so happy. I love finding new recipes. That was like one of my favorite parts of early game. And it's just really like nice to be able to do that again. All right, we're gonna build some stuff. Let's craft. I want to make a vaulting pole and I want to make a shovel. Ta-da! A shovel. Ta-da! I'm done. Oh, hey Cherry, what's up? So I figured out how to make that shovel from this awesome collection of DIYs I got with my Miles. If I remember right, it's called Pretty Good Tools Recipe. So far, everything I've built from there has been super sturdy. Anyway, if you did with that shovel, go get that collection. You'll be buried in shovels in no time. Okay, cool. Oh, she gave me like proper shovel. That's awesome. Thanks, thank you. Uh-oh, he has fleas. Remember that time Wilbo was trying to get fleas? Hey, Wilbo, this one's for you, buddy. <laughs> yes, I caught a flea. The curse is lifted. Oh, there goes my net. I guess that's it for my flimsy net. Was there a flea on me? I've been so absorbed in my strength taint training i didn't even know it's i think he meant fishing hmm guess that maybe i should take a bath once in a while thanks groove no problem we did it easy look at him doing nothing that lazy boy he's so lazy look at him thinks he can do whatever he wants he don't care yo there's a big fish right there and i want it but i don't have a fishing pole i don't have a fishing pole i gotta go make a fishing pole shoo okay we're ready i also need a net though uh aha oh man i hope that fish is still here come on 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 big fish big fish big fish plays he's still there here. Yeah. Here, fishy, fishy. Here, fishy. Fi oh yeah, you you want that? Ha 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 ha! Oh, it's just a bass. Did I get? Oh no, I haven't caught this one yet. I caught a black bass. It's the most metal fish of all. Let's go. We're gonna drop him outside again, right where he belongs. And also this flea. I like that the flea is like dead. It looks so dead. No! Oh wait, I have a vaulting pole. I can actually get over there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I was so worried. <laughs> yes! I caught an agrius butterfly. I wonder if it makes it disagreeable. Agreeable. Agrius. Oh, we haven't been over on this side of the island yet, so why don't we start exploring? And I'll catch this little fish. Just in case. Just in case it's a new one. Oh, I done goofed that up. Alright, well. We can get the fossil that we needed. Yoink. 
fossil time. Excellent, excellent. Ooh, I can finally see this little island. So this one's pretty narrow, which is a little unfortunate. I would, this is one of the things I was looking for to have like a bigger version of, but I do like this whole setup where it's like pretty close to the back and we have nice big rocks back here. Also, I forgot that these things exist and they kind of freak me out, but I used to play with these in the sand as a kid. Yes, I caught a wharf roach. Uh-oh, I can't carry anything. Let's swap it. We'll swap it with something random, like, uh, like this bug I already donated. See ya. I literally was not ready for this. No! <laughs> they caught up to me. Never mind. Looks like I got stung by wasps again. She's like, I'm gonna pretend I didn't see that. If I don't look at her, hey, everything's totally normal. I'm not gonna look at your face. Oh, wow, this is a nice sky up there. Yeah, I'm not gonna say a word. I hope she doesn't talk to me. Hey, gosh darn it, she talked to me. Whoa, what's up with your face? Did you get stung by a wasp? Does it hurt? You okay? Yeah, they can be mean sometimes or all times. Gotta be careful around them, you know? Um, well, it's kind of too late to be careful now, but you know what I mean. Still not helpful. Maybe Teddy will help feel bad for me and make me medicine. Teddy, will you help me? Y you were stung by a wasp? Take some medicine, get better then. You guys are so unhelpful. I don't have any medicine. I'm just gonna shake all these trees. Maybe I can find the other wasp and catch it. Ooh, money. Ooh, money. We gotta come across it eventually. Nope. Oh my god, there's a dead bird on my beach. Let's poke with a stick. Aye, uh, yeah, storms are coming. Brace yourselves, lads. Hard to starboard, tough to port, stern to stern. Weigh anchor, check its blood pressure. Who's your provider? Yum, 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 yum. Do you have a pickled herring pizza? I tipped down mine, so wait, I don't see a pizza. Where am I? Who are you? Who am I? Oh, hang on, I know that one. I'm none Oliver than Gulliver, the seafaring seagull of the seven seas. Were you the one who kept nudging me just now? Thanks for the wake-up call. Those tasty hallucinations tend to sneak up on me. Can you find it in your heart to forgive this waterlogged bird brain? I'm reading your vacant expression as a yes. Whew. I don't think it's a vacant expression. I think it's that my face got stung. <laughs> And I'm like, dude, my eye hurts. And this guy is like dead on my beach. It's kind of a weird day, man. Guess I dozed off and tumbled overboard again. That's an endearing character trait of mine. My crewmates love it when I slip off the bow. Oh, my, uh, oh my gosh. My handy dandy communicator's broken. All right, so now I'm gonna go have to find his handy dandy notebook. Yeah, I'll look for him. I haven't gotten this reception since sweet and bubbly since I was washed on Coral Cola. Is anybody's island name called Coral Cola? Because that would be cool if they just grabbed names of islands. But then he'd be like, I haven't had this nice of reception since I arrived on butts. <laughs> so maybe, maybe that wouldn't be a good idea. All right, let's get some communicator parts. Communicator part. Two, three... Four. Just kidding. That's a real one. Four. Just kidding. Four. Just kidding. Dude, I swear he was right here. What happened? Oh, there it is. Four. <laughs> and five. Hooray! That's all of them. Let's go back to that bird brain. Hey, did you find him? Yep, got him right here. Here you go. So cute. All right, the pieces are crammed back up in here. Let's see if we can get to send a message. Ahoy there, crew. It's me, your brother from another brother. So listen, it happened again. Can you swing by and pick me up? Sending my coordinates now. Gulliver over and out. There, that should do it. See you later. Bye, Gulliver. I forgot that we upgraded our house. Inspire others to come out of their shells today, Aquarius. Have them join you on the sunny side of the street. Share your cheer with other people and lead them into a boisterous discussion about the world. You'll be on cloud nine with a great deal of strength behind your happy-go-lucky emotion. Keep things light and don't worry until tomorrow comes. I can give you a new reading every day for just a thousand pills. Um, thanks, Terry. I'll, uh, see you tomorrow.